In this video, we'll be looking at two nodes, the parser and the formatter. What the parser does is it takes a number in a text format and converts it to a number in a number format. So all you have to do is send the number in the text format to text here, trigger parse, and it will output the number in the number format out of the number output, if that makes sense. Just like that. And if your number in the text format has a bunch of letters or something that it can't convert, it will trigger fail. It also has a built-in number decorator down here, so you can decorate it in different ways. Another node is a formatter, and this converts any text or any value into text, and it also allows you to format it. So right now I'm sending 3333 to v1, and my format string will be hello hashtag v1 hashtag. And so now the output will be hello and then whatever v1 was, which was 3333. So you can change this however you want, and you can use multiple v1, v2, v3, v4, just like that. Now my v2 is going to be v2. Oh, I guess that's a number I clicked. <laughs> so now I'll put it like that. So here's where I used one in my lag detector here. I want to have ticks per second, then the ticks per second, and then sketch speed and the sketch speed. So once I processed all the data, I sent it to a formatter with those ticks per second, hashtag v1, hashtag sketch speed, hashtag v1, hashtag percent. And then I send it in there, and then it will output a nice formatted text message. Just like that.